The fourth approach that you could use to determine the type of business that you should start is to analyze what type of experience you have, what knowledge or expertise you have, and see where you could package that knowledge, that experience, and where you could offer it in the world. Many of us have years of experience in a particular department or position in a particular industry. And with that experience, we gained and retained a lot of knowledge about that industry, about that you know, department, about that role, and about whatever it is that our job or our experience is in. In addition to that, there's a lot of people that go to school and they get a lot of knowledge and they get degrees in specific areas. And when you take this approach, you have to analyze what areas do you have a, a lot of knowledge or experience in. If this is the approach that you wanna take, find a way to package your experience and knowledge into a product or a service and market it to your desired customer. A lot of new businesses start off this way. Think of any new law firms or any new restaurants. Most times the owner of the new firm or the new restaurant started off in a larger restaurant or law firm and they took their experience, they took their knowledge, they took their desire to create something under their name or the name that they come up with and they created their own business entity under their experience or with their experience. And you could literally do that with pretty much any type of industry or career field. So, so just like those two examples, you could take whatever your experience is and you may have to team up with somebody else that you know that has experience in a different department or a different area that can help you create a bigger or a more solid entity and find a way to create that business entity, find a way to create a product or a service around your knowledge and experience and offer it to your ideal customers.